Went away. She said she didn't want to come. She ain't want to come here, but you going to go to town. Live with her. Live with her. Take it up with her. Oh, we will. I'm about to call her. A, a sister. Sister. We don't see you nowhere. Where you? What you, what you doing? Um, resting. Resting. Right and a lot of other stuff. A lot of other stuff like what? This Stephanie. You uh, Mm-mm. I heard you just ain't wanna come. I'm not gonna beat around the bush. <laughs> Because I expected to see my new sister-in-law, and I don't see you, and I'm not going to lie, I feel away. Bro, bro, we good, sister. We're not going to start off like that. We would never exclude you. Don't exclude yourself. Oh, yeah. Yes, we really wanted to meet you. You got yeah. family here. It's T-Dog right here. This is T-Dog. You yawning? Yeah, we going to call you back because you tired. I'm not trying to be that one, but I'm going to be that you one. You can be whatever you want. I'm not You're my direct my sister. You yelling at us because your wife ain't want to come to your party. You free. And she was dry on the phone. I don't care how much you got the night before. You be more energized when you get some good This definitely raised a red flag for me about Harris because if you don't show up just because, it was just a big, to me, middle finger. OK, nephew. I have all the questions and concerns from an Ani perspective. And it's like, not only did he just get married, he just came home. He's on paper. What is he going to do for money? How is he going to provide for this family? Just trust me. It's going to be OK. OK, you say trust you. This came out the same mouth that just had to go finish doing time because you wanted to drink some liquor. So what happens if something happened and you still on paper? Something happened and something happened because I'm on paper. Oh, well. Then you're going back to jail and you got to wait. But I got to do the time. Y'all don't got to do the but time. But it's just still an effect upon us because we love you. I love you, too. Just trust me. Oh, Can you please trust me? We have real concerns as your family. We don't know this woman. Maybe a part of me is stuck in three and a half years ago, three years ago, and the immaturity of decisions he's made, and to come home, and it's like, are you ready for all of this responsibility of being a husband? I don't know if my nephew is ready for all of that.